The Scene of the Crime is presented by Billy Johnson, Jr., Attorney at Law. On February 4, 2017, Clancy Adkins, who had recently entered remission from cancer, was found shot dead in his home here on Coon Branch in the Island Creek community in Pike County. I'm uh, Clancy's older sister. I was the oldest one in the family. Clancy's the baby. He had been sick, like maybe all summer. And we took him to the hospital and they ran a bunch of tests on him. And they sent him to Cabo Huntington and they told us down there that it was leukemia. And he stayed down there for about a year in the hospital. About six months before I think they got killed, it was, you know, he went in remission and, you know, he was doing pretty good, you know. I mean, he's still weak at times, but, and he didn't get out a lot, you know, because he's, you know, sick, but he was doing pretty good when he got killed. He come down at Christmas, and that was last Christmas, you know, that he'd spent with us. What exactly happened that day remains a mystery. He has a mother that's 77. And she's really sick, you know. And someone needs to come forward. I'd hate for her to die, and, you know, and not knowing that, you know, who killed him and why. And he's got grandkids that, you know, that talks about him every day. One's three years old, and that's all she talks about. And it's just hard, you know, not knowing who done this. So someone needs to come forward, you know. Even if it's just a little something, they don't think it even means anything, that, you know, it might mean something. If you or anyone you know has any information regarding the case of Clancy Atkins, please contact Detective Jason Merlo at the number on your screen. Reporting in Pikeville, I'm Polly Hopkins for EKB News.